Hey everyone, this is Dino Sasha here, and welcome back to another review. And today we're gonna take a look at the figure. It is the Schleich 2020 Postasugus. Now, Postasugus, which name means crocodile from post, is a genus of Rauisuchid reptile from the late Triassic period, which came across many years ago. It is now lived in North America. The length was about 5 to 6 meters, 16 to 20 feet long, and of course, the height is about 1.2 meters, 3.9 feet tall, and weighed about 250 to 450 kilograms, or 550 to 990 pounds. Now, the Postasuchus is one of the more unique predators on the time periods, and is the largest predator on the Triassic period. Which means, the Postasuchus is one of the more dominant predators in the Triassic North America until become extinct when dinosaurs rule there. Now, it is a member of the family Rurusuchidae, which its closest relative of the Postasuchus was none other than the actual Prestasuchus. Which, so they made. Now, Postasuchus was being a carnivore, hunting down Placerius, which means it is a large, lumbering, and armored herbivore with tusks. Now, it is also being the largest known carnivore to in Triassic land, Earth. Now, the reason is, I'll talk something else. It's that, uh, I'll talk about the pose. I mean, the uh, sculpt, I mean, of course. The sculpt is a very decent, but... I don't know about you guys, but the sculpt is very nice sculpting. Now, it sure is nice sculpting on the post of Sucus. I mean, it's a pretty cool reptile, I'm gonna say. It's a pretty damn good, and I believe this is the most important creature on the planet could have this design good. Now, about that, let's just thinking of something else about really quickly, it's this design. So, the sculpt is really nice indeed, and let's talk about the pose, it's walking pose rather than hunting pose, it is, it's more walking and a hunting pose, which the post of Sucus had this tactic, but, still a good pose though, but the details is a bit rough to me, which it has a very good crocodile scoots on it, which basically for a, for a reptile, that's more like a crocodile morph to me, which basically, so the Postasuchus may be resembled to many more creatures. Now, have you seen the Watch 65, which is a quadrupedal creature, kind of look like a, you know, a basic Fossilosuchus, which that makes sense, you know, because Fossilosuchus live in the Triassic because it does not live in Cretaceous, though. But Postasuchus is pretty nice. So, Let's talk about very recent about it. It's the color scheme. Now the color scheme is a bit more different. It is silver in color, which is all the way here, and especially the green on their head, which the green top on the armor, which basically an animal that was trying to be in a survival. And I believe it's a pretty nice addition of the Postasuchus. But the problem issue was its head. I mean, we have an articulated jaw though, and the tongue was perfectly sculpted, and I believe that this Postasuchus may have resembled more like a T-Rex, which the head was more like a Tyrannosaurus, but it has a crack at its eyes, I think, which, in my opinion, it kind of looked like spectacle, but in this figure over here, it doesn't do much more like a crack hide, which, it looks kind of perfect, because eyelids are too flappy or something, but I'm okay with that, but because of the dinosaur-like appearance, it's still a animal with closest relatives, so the accuracy is pretty nice, and I believe it's a pretty good addition on the Postasuchus in the, my collection, but the recent years is, is how the look of its creature, and I believe the Postasuchus may have deserved a chance, so I may thinking this is a pretty nice, accurate Postasuchus, but if you know this figure, let me know think in the comments if you think about it for the accuracy. So let's take a look at the size measurements, so let's bring up a ruler. So for the length, which means the tip of the head on the tip of the tail, we're looking at about 
almost right about, as uh, we can see, it's almost reaching at about 7.2 inches, and which is only at about, as we can see, we're gonna reach only at about almost 18.2 centimeters. Now, the height on top of the back, we're looking at 2.1 inches, and which is only at about five centimeters. Now, for comparison, I'm gonna bring up some other crocodile-like animals, but only Triassic ones. And here's with the Safari LTD 2018 Prestosuchus. Now, Prestosuchus is way bigger than a Postosuchus. Now, currently, the two look alike, but they're completely different animal species on this family. Now, Postosuchus is a member of the Rhesusuchidae family because it's closest relatives of the the Tetrasuchus, while the Prestosuchus its closest relative with the Prestosuchidae family, which. I don't know about that, but it's still a good figure. I'm gonna link the Prestosuchus in the link in the description box down below. And for a final comparison, here's with the Collecte 2022 Deluxe Smok Wawelski. Now, Smok is an absolute unit of the more reptiles because Smok may look like a dinosaur, but it's an archosaur nonetheless. Kind of look like a large crocodile, which, due to live in Poland, Presto live in South America, and Posto live in North America. I'm also gonna link in the description box down below, and the rating of that Posto Sucus, and I'm gonna give it a basic 7 out of 10, which the head may be the problem, but everyone's is okay. So people reviewing as some like an accurate Posto Sucus, which people thought that was worse, but in my opinion, it's just a crocodile on the design. So if you know about this figure, let me know in the comments. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, and click the bell for notifications so you'll never miss the video. Leave a comment below, and I hope you see you for another review about the Papo 2017 Ceratosaurus. Goodbye everyone, and see you all next time on this channel.